In Uganda, one hospital is saving the lives of premature babies by feeding them breast milk donated to its bank by well-wishers. The breast milk donations are increasing fast, despite the practice having not been embraced by many mothers in Uganda. The hospital says it has saved the lives of premature babies by at least 30 percent since it opened the breast milk bank a year ago. CGTN's Isabel Nakuria has more details. Asha Mary delivered quadruplets at 25 weeks in May after developing complications with her pregnancy. She was also unable to breastfeed her preterm babies because she didn't have enough milk. Doctors at the hospital in Kampala recommended only breast milk. Asha had no choice but to look for a breast milk donor. Since I don't have anyone who can give my babies, my sisters, they are not breastfeeding, and I don't have relative who is breastfeeding. That's why the doctor decided to help me and bring that donor. Unfortunately, Asha lost two of her babies, but the remaining two are now back home and out of danger. The WHO says prematurity is the leading cause of death in children under five years globally. Asha's babies are now three months old, but she still doesn't have enough breast milk for them. She still depends on breast milk from Adona, and she's also supplementing with formula milk, which was recommended to her by her doctor. Breast milk donation is not very popular in Uganda because many mothers don't trust their babies feeding on milk from strangers. However, demand is picking up. I know it is not easy, but I have faith in my heart, and I believe that that woman really, uh, since he's breastfeeding the, the, his baby, I, I have faith that my babies will be healthy. So far, only the International Hospital in Kampala is trying to promote breast milk donations, but only for preterm babies. Its nurses were the first donors before rolling it out to the public. Breast milk has been found safe and nutritious for babies because it reduces risks linked to formula milk. We used to have babies undergoing surgeries because of the complete of the formula milk. So breast milk research had done had, had been done on it and showed that breast milk is soft. It's the natural thing and does everything. It has protect it has protective measures in it, the antibiotics. So the antibodies that we are found in the breast milk could even protect the baby's immunity and then boost it more further so that the babies could fight infection naturally. The hospital has now opened a breast milk bank to save preterm lives. So far, the hospital has started distributing breast milk to hospitals around Kampala but their capacity is still low. It needs a pasteurizing machine to be able to have bigger and safe quantities of milk for babies, but this is a costly venture. Asha says her babies are growing well and have not developed any complications despite being fed on milk from a stranger. She's calling on mothers with excess breast milk to donate to babies in great need. Isabel Nakiria, CGTN Kampala, Uganda.